What's up, heaven made gang creator mind? It's your girl, the creator mind of Bree, and I'm back with another video for you guys today. And I hope you are having a blessed day. Um, I have a message for you guys just just now, just came, and it's a certain situation that other people may be going through, just through life anyway. And if you're, you know, coming to this message today or any other day, I just I say I, I ask God, I pray for you. I uh, ask God to cover you in his blood and, you know, create a better day, a better future for you if you're not having a good day. And if you are, uh, continue to strive to make it even better. So before I get into it, I just want to pray. Father God, I thank you for today. I thank you for my watchers, Father God, my viewers. I ask you, Father God, to be the voice, Father God. Take my whatever thoughts and and desires father god that i have father god take that away father god and put everything uh into this to with your voice father god and your desires your will be done father god in jesus mighty name amen so yeah i know it's been a minute so i just want to come on here how and, and you know talk about uh how the devil can play confusion or your mind anyway because you've been programmed sometimes the enemy can just set a seed negative seed or positive seed so sometimes we get in our ways where we praying to god about our children asking him yes lord i got this uh information about my child but i believe your word and i'm praying on i'm believing for a breakthrough a miracle lord and other things may breakthrough he see that the blessing is coming he knows that you're about to get it he's trying his very hardest to stop you or make you uh mess up to get it so just keep that in mind as well i um like i was saying you probably been praying for something about your child and all this stuff start happening and you and you actually have a, a, a breakthrough some of your breakthrough come through some of your prayers being answered that you've been praying for and it doesn't seem that big anymore and you forget to praise god you forget to praise him through all the things that you have asked for or been through but instead we're just talking about what's going on like my pastor said once it's a tree that's being focused on but all the other ones are blurred. You're forgetting all the blessings. You're forgetting all the things that he did and what he do every day. And just because of a mouth or something that's happening. So we got to stop doing that. But that's, that's mainly it. Just focus on the things that God has every day for you. Waking up, being able to touch, being able to feel, being able to breathe. All of those things that we're able to do. Hold on. So I just wanted to make sure... Then I'll let you guys know that things, ob obstacles may come, things may come your way, try to deter you from your path, but make sure you stay focused on God, stay prayed up, stay reading the word, and start looking at the things, not only what he has have done, what he's doing, but just of who he is, period. Um, and I just, I just pray the blood of Jesus over you guys, and I'll, I pray that your, the rest of your week be bl uh, a blessing and encourage somebody else. And also go to Dominion City, Georgia on Facebook or DominionCityGeorgia.org um, for a prayer meeting at 6 in the morning every day. Um, you will bl be blessed for yourself, your family, your loved ones, and even your church and whoever you're, who your leadership is. But just remember that because he can always try to pull you back from the world to try to pull you back and to suck you in. But you got to stay firm. Alright you guys, make sure you like, comment, and subscribe. I'll see you guys soon. Bye.